The Caribbean Youth Science Forum, CYSF, unified six form students from the region as they explored their passion for science, technology, engineering, and mathematics. The National Institute of Higher Education, Research, Science, and Technology, NIHIST, facilitated almost 100 students from Jamaica, Barbados, Grenada, and St. Lucia, alongside those from Trinidad and Tobago in housing at the University of the West Indies. This balanced experience combined enthralling lectures from industry and academic professionals, plus interactive workshops and debates, with the opportunity to question and interact with these experts at the Socializing with Scientists event. Here we have three performers from the official opening ceremony. Honestly, I enjoyed this a lot. It was put together by Melissa Jack right here. Melissa, this is all her and her amazingness. And she, um, she had it by herself and then she brought me along. I offered her some backup and then we brought Chantel along and Chantel just filled out the whole thing. It was a great, it was just a, like everything at CYSF, it was a wonderful way of just coming together. But the students weren't confined to the lecture halls. Field trips to sites where science came to life brought lots of excitement. Hands-on exhibits and on-the-spot challenges were the highlight of the visit to the National Science Center. Later in the week, students presented in the Design Challenge activity in which they utilized their critical thinking and problem-solving skills to navigate this year's scenario. You and your team have been left stranded on Mars. The survival of the colony depends on your team building a device that can measure time and create an alarm at two time intervals. Your team must build this timing mechanism using recyclable and reusable materials. At another day, they had to present their models and their design journal to judges and their peers. At the Science Seekers activity, students entered the wild and learned valuable survival skills like fire building, shelter construction, rope bridging, roll challenge and field expedient navigation, encouraging cooperation and team effort. Caribbean Night allowed the students to share their culture and talents with their new friends. Singing, dancing and wordplay delighted the crowd. Future music stars were evident by overwhelming audience response and participation. Because I participated in as much activities as possible, which would include the debate challenge, the design challenge, and I did a bit of modeling for me and my group. I just want to thank the CYSA for what they are doing because coming here this year has given me more guidance into where I wanted to go. Because coming here, I just had my subjects and I did my CAPE subjects. But now I know what to do with it at this point. So CYSF was an amazing experience. I learned way more than I actually thought I would. I thought I was coming here to learn about science, but I learned so much more. I learned about creativity, teamwork, friendship, leadership. I learned about art, and those, those were so many things that I didn't think I would learn about when I came here. It was an amazing experience, and I made a lot of lifelong friends, as you can see. <laughs> and I recommend this camp to anybody who want, who's interested in the sciences. At the concert, Winners were announced for the design challenge, the debate competition, and the social media competition. Several persons were also awarded for their lifelong contribution to the CYSF events over the years. The Forum Olympics rounded off the week with a slew of physical games and challenges as students cheered each other on and let their competitive sides shine before saying their last goodbyes.